Today there is a sickness among the Muslims. You know what is this sickness? What is the scientific explanation for this? This is the sickness nowadays. Everything has to be explained scientifically. Are you following? There are certain things you cannot explain. Why you Muslims you eat the, the you don't eat the the flesh of the spine, pig, pole. You know, there is a worm inside. That is by, by product. Did the Sahaba knew about that? Or they left it because Allah said so? Tell me. Allah said so. Allah said, don't eat it, we don't eat it. Don't drink alcohol, we don't drink alcohol. Don't you see some doctors today, they say, you know, brandy is medicinal. You know that? Doctors, yes. Little brandy is good. Wine after food is good. And they are doctors. Do we follow them? When the doctor came to the Prophet ﷺ and he said, I use the alcohol, the liquor, to treat my patients, what the Prophet ﷺ said? Inna da wa laysa tbi dawa. It is a disease itself. The khamar itself is a disease. It's not a cure. Today, if the whole world are saying, riba is halal. And you have no option, you have to do riba. Will that make riba halal? If the whole world they want khamar, will that make it halal? They, might, they want zina, they want... We will make that halal. Finish. That's why we Muslims say, it is Allah whom we accepted as our creator and Allah knows and we don't know. Wallahu ya'lamu wa antum la ta'lamun. Allah knows and you don't know. So it is the Iman. It is the Iman. So not everything, what is the scientific explanation? Why it was the scientific explanation that Maghrib is still in Raqqa? Why the fact of Raqqa? Why we do three times? Why not five? Why not seven? Understand? So it is the ibadah again that we are servants of Allah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, out of His mercy, He allows us to come and to know some hikmah. These are just byproducts, they come along. But the most important thing is the iman that the Creator said so.